Good afternoon, I'm Dave Percy at the National Weather Service with Saturday's Alaska Statewide Weather. Storm system and associated front brought wind and rain to much of the southeast coast uh, throughout the day on Saturday. Heidelberg had wind gusts to 46 miles per hour while Juneau received gusts to 35 miles per hour at the airport. Rainfall ranged from over an inch at uh, Ketchikan to about 17 hundredths at Juneau. Along the Arctic coast, uh, easterly winds gusted 20 to 30 miles per hour with uh, areas of low clouds and fog. And over the Alaska Peninsula, high pressure building over the central Bering Sea associated with low pressure in the Gulf created winds across the Alaska Peninsula from the north gusting as high as 40 miles per hour at Falls Pass. Those winds will diminish and shift eastward, so there'll be a little bit of an increase in the winds from roughly uh, Sitkanak in across the eastern Alaska Peninsula with breezes in Bristol Bay. Winds will be light under high pressure over the eastern Bering Sea with areas of low clouds, fog, rain, and drizzle covering much of the area with IFR conditions. And it'll stay damp out to the west as the warm front lifts northward and weakens. Look for isolated thunderstorms over interior Alaska dissipating this evening. And for tomorrow, thunderstorm activity is possible over the Susitna Valley, Kenai Peninsula, and western Alaska Range in the afternoon. Otherwise, showers will be scattered across Copper River Basin. It'll be showery across the Panhandle. Look for mostly sunny skies with a chance of an afternoon shower over the mountains or Kodiak Island. Should be mostly clear, partly to mostly sunny over southern Cook Inlet, the southwest interior, as well as the Midtown and Awe Valley, 40 mile country northward to the Brooks Range. There could also be some clearing along the eastern Arctic coast. And then for Monday, Frontal system will push eastward across central Aleutian Sunday night and bring rain and wind to the Fox Islands early and into the Alaska Peninsula during the afternoon with possible gale force winds once again. It'll be fair over the Yukon Cusquam Delta with sunshine and for Kodiak Island looks to be partly sunny, possible clouds increasing in the afternoon. Isolated thunderstorms are possible over the Kenai Peninsula western Alaska range and just east of the Nalato Hills. With Alaska Statewide Weather, I'm Dave Percy.